everybody, it's Bunny. I don't have the heart to take down my Greco-Roman hair yet, and therefore I thought I would film another video. That's why I'm still in the same hair and makeup and clothes and all that jazz. But in my mailbox on Friday, I got another Beauty Box 5, which is another monthly subscription box service that you can get. And I've unboxed a couple of these in the past. The company sends them to me for free to try out. I haven't done an unboxing boxing of one of these in a couple months because they just mysteriously stopped showing up one day. But I don't know, I don't really question things like that. I'm just kind of grateful for whatever shows up to me that I have the opportunity to try. And so here it is again back in September. I've tried a couple other of these unboxing sampling services in the past that have come my way. So far this one is my favorite service out of all of the services that I have tried. This company is actually pretty locally based for me. They are outside of Austin and pretty much everything that comes out of Austin, Texas is really badass. So uh, maybe that's why I'm partial to Beauty Box 5. I finally figured out in my last unboxing of one of these why it's called 5 is because there's five thingies to try inside of here. In boxes past I've actually discovered a lot of new favorite products like the Psst brand dry shampoo and then one time I got like a cargo eye tinted primer thing. So I don't know. I've gotten some pretty cool products out of here in the past. So why don't I just slice it open? I brought my little handy dandy cutting utensil here. These are my friends. I should probably not be given sharp objects, but slicey slicey cannot do anything. Okay, slicing, slicing. We can get this party started. Ha! Oh. Mm, so there you go. This is what it is. You get a card. I think most beauty service things put a little card in here. This tells you more about the products that are inside. At least I know Birchbox does that. I've never had a Birchbox myself, but I watch Leanne says his Birchbox videos every month and she always gets one of these little thingies. Everything always comes neatly in a little like drawstring baggie like you would get jewelry in. And then it also always has like confetti, which is <laughs> confetti. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay, this one I'm just now kind of like seeing the inside and this one may be my favorite one ever. Actually, I know it's gonna be my favorite one ever. I just know it is. First thing I'm seeing is a hydrating shampoo in Hydro Punch, which either sounds like something I want to consume or something violent that I want to stay out of the way of. I don't really know yet. It's by a brand called Numi, which I swear I have seen somewhere before. I don't know if it would be like beauty brands. I would probably say beauty brands because they have Tens of shampoo and hair products. Ah, okay. I will not be able to use this. So I'm probably going to end up getting this sample to my mom. I always give my mom like samples and stuff that either I think she would like or if it's something I can't use. I obviously have super colored hair enhancement. None of these colors are actually my real legitimate hair color. So if you have color treated hair, you're not supposed to use any shampoos that have any sulfates in them. And I see that the second ingredient in this right after water is sodium coleth sulfate. I have no idea. It says it's a hydrating shampoo. The full size of this product would be $24.99. Next thing in here, oh it's a lip shine. H. Wood Lips. I've never heard of this brand before. Maybe H. Wood stands for Hollywood. I really like the typography on this box. I'm kind of one of those like suckers for packaging and typography, things like that. I don't know. I just am. Um, aren't we all? I think that's the purpose of like, you know, marketing and packaging and stuff is to entice us to purchase things. I see on the top of the box that the color is rose and I, this is my first time seeing any products like this. I really, really like the tube. This looks like a full size product. It's gold, obviously, and it's kind of got this like imprint on it. I don't know. It looks very 1920s. I don't know if that's kind of like the vibe of the company, but based on the typography and now the packaging of the product, that's kind of 
the vibe that I'm getting. This item, it says, retails for $16, and there's a code on here to receive 25% off of hwoodbeauty.com. So let's see what color this is. Ooh, this looks like a very, very, you know, rosy color. It's very vibrant kind of pink. I'm gonna go ahead and swatch it because maybe a lot of you guys like me. Okay, there's nothing really to swatch. Um, it definitely is a shine. You're not even gonna be able to see this. So this is very, very sheer. So I think this is perfect for everybody because I'm gonna assume it just conditions the lips. So I don't know. I really like the entire like vibe that it's going on here and how it's just like really nice and simple. I may take this on my trip with me to Disney World because it just kind of looks like a nice universal thing that would offer lip protectant. I don't see anything else about like SPF or anything, but it does say that it's very, very moisturizing. Alrighty. Next thing I saw that I am super jazzed about is this set of false eyelashes. I love false eyelashes. Any kind of different set or brand that I see, I like to try always just for extra dramatic days. So I actually don't see, I don't know if like natural is the brand. It says Holly Rin is the brand. I have no idea. I've never heard of that brand before, but I mean, doesn't really matter. I don't know. I don't really get too caught up on brands of false eyelashes. I buy false eyelashes at like the costume store before. I bought them at the dollar store before. So I don't really care about like name brand false eyelashes. These will definitely be fun to have around, especially with Halloween coming up. I'm going to try and be doing a lot of different Halloween eye looks, a lot of dramatic different things. So that'll be nice to have just an extra pair of lashes around. Next thing I'm seeing is a little pot of eyeshadow and it's by a brand called Sierra Silk Naturals. I've never heard of that brand before. It's just like, you know, a little um, sample size. I'm gonna assume that this is a sample size. I'll go ahead and swatch it for you. It looks like a nice kind of sparkly tan shade, if that makes any sense whatsoever. I don't know. This is actually gorgeous and definitely a color that I would wear. I love natural shade eyeshadows. I think it looks pretty good on my skin more than like, you know, the rainbow or bright colors. I tend to always wear like golds or I guess the most dramatic color I go for is like a red. Here is the color right here. It's pretty light actually. I don't have any eyeshadow base of course on my hands so uh, that's just with the eyeshadow color. I hope that you guys can see it. It's just very shimmery, you know, really natural color. I've never heard of this brand before but I'm looking forward to trying it out. This, it says also is a loose mineral shadow. It's gluten free and predominantly vegan. I don't exactly know what that means. It's like almost vegan. I'm gonna go ahead and put like the different websites to these different products down below because this is like a lot of new and kind of cool looking stuff that I've never heard of before. So just in case y'all want to check out any of this stuff for yourself. This is the other product that I saw that I was extremely excited about because it looks like a little bath thing and I didn't exactly read what it is yet, but I did see that it says angel kisses. It is a bath melt and I love different like soaps and fizzies and treatments and things like that for the bath. So this is called Goat House and it's spelled in the German way which I like because I'm German. Goat House Dairy and this has even the little Texas symbol on it and just okay 99% of Texans were just super jazzed about Texas so anytime you like put a stamp of Texas on something I'm gonna be 10,000 times more amped about it. This is what the packaging looks like. I kind of like how it's like a little bit like shiny fiery red. It's a really cool fall color. It gets me jazzed for fall. I kind of like this old style pastoral kind of like, I imagine some kind of like traveling wagon in ye olden wild west days. I kind of like wild west stuff. And then it says things like makers and purveyors. See how olden, ye olden that sounds? Of wonderfully handcrafted, genuine, 
goat milk toiletries. So this is a bath melt. Goat House Dairy is a Texas family owned and operated dairy. We strive to excel in producing the finest handcrafted goat milk toiletries available. You're just supposed to drop this whole thing in your tub and it just relaxes you and moisturizes your skin and it says that this retails for $2.50 which is kind of cheap in my opinion. That's not really that expensive so I'm probably going to hang on to this little fella until it gets closer to the winter because winter till it gets closer to winter um till it gets closer to the winter because my skin tends to dry out more at that time so it'll be nice to have a little pampering treat to help bring some moisture back into my skin so this is by far my favorite favorite spread of products from beauty box 5 that i have ever gotten i love lipsticks lipstick is my favorite makeup thing ever and i of course am super jazzed to try out the goat goat melt that almost sounds kind of wicked when I say it like that. And then I love false eyelashes. So those are my three favorite products, but there's literally nothing that I am disappointed with this time. Even though I'm not gonna be able to use the shampoo, I still think that this is a pretty good sample size and good for like taking on trips and traveling and stuff like that. So I'm just gonna give this one to my mom. That is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll have links to all the different things down below and I don't get any like extra credits or anything if you like click on this thing they send this to me for free just to trample trample out just to sample and show to you guys and I'm always happy to do it because I honestly like this service hopefully I'll be fortunate enough to get some more beauty boxes in the future I really like this subscription service I think it's ten dollars if I remember correctly and you get five sample things in the little turquoise box a month so it's something just kind of fun and cool to receive and I'm definitely very grateful for the opportunity to get it and try it I like it um, uh, that is the end my friends so I hope you guys enjoyed this video I love you guys I hope you're all doing well this week it is almost October October oh bra strap hello sassy if you want to take a minute to subscribe I would love to have you here just press that button and become a member of the swamp family also if you want you can like me on Facebook facebook.com slash graveyard girl or you can follow me on Twitter Tumblr Instagram at graveyard girl and I will see you guys later bye